Long I one. need a drink. Oh, oh my goodness. That was a fun challenge, I will say. Crazy how good the food is. I think if this was one of our normal seasons, half the people would have went down on this challenge. Let's wait and see. Well, yeah. Oh my God. Oh. Hi. We'd like to see Gabri, John, Luciana, Ali, May, and Sylvia. Thank you. May, Ali, and Gabri, you three had our favorite dishes of the day. How does it feel? Pretty good. Pretty good. Feels it's comfortable now. Yeah. It's redemption. Tell us about your dish. My dish was inspired by my favorite dish that my mother made for me, which is mole negro and also arroz verde. So I just want to mix those things. I just love the idea of mashing up these two different cuisines. And I think it makes sense because I think some of the best risottos often have an earthy component. It was just a, a beautiful plate of food that I would have any day. I appreciate it. Ali, how did the day go for you? It was a bit challenging cooking outside the kitchen, especially because my dish normally is cooked in it under the ground. Yes. So I brought some charcoal, covered it, and it gave it that smokiness flavor. First thing that hit me was that smokiness in the most beautiful way. It woke me up because it was so different. Thank you so much. Thank you. You gave us a rice dish. Often rice dishes could be boring. This was exciting. Thank you, sir. May, you and I get immunity. I will try to do my best. I would like to dedicate this dish to my mom and my grandma, so I respect to the recipe. I love that you made dessert. It's great to see that. I thought the sweet potato was just a great foil because it's inherently sweet, and it also created another texture, even though it was soft, and then the crispy rice cracker was spectacular. The fact that this is a dish that was inspired by your mom and your grandma just makes it even more special. So well done. Thank you. Sorry, I just grow up with my mom cooking. Mm -hmm. She's making dessert to sell in the market to taking care of our family. You really honored the women in your family. You did a beautiful job. Well done, May. Well done. Thank you. The three of you had our favorite dishes of the day, but there can only be one winner. The chef today who wins the challenge really understood the brief. They highlighted rice in the most beautiful, balanced way. And the winner for this challenge is... Ali. And I'm the winner of the second elimination challenge. This is huge, this is big for me. It feels great uh, being back. <laughs> it's uh, not an adrenaline rush, it's more of a top chef rush. It's a feeling we're chasing. Yeah. I'm sorry, mom, but today I cook better Uzi than you.